Hey guys, so today I thought it would be fun to bring you guys thrifting with me, of course, but today we're actually gonna go visit every single thrift store in my city. So there's about four different thrift stores that we're gonna go to today. And the first one that we're actually at right now, I've actually never been to, so it's gonna be really exciting. And today I'm on the hunt for a denim jacket because if you guys don't know, I have my own Depop and Instagram shop where I sell reworked pieces and I'm looking for a jacket for my next creation basically so that's what we're gonna be on the lookout for for today and i think it's gonna be really interesting to you know compare the selection the prices and all that let's head into our first thrift store okay so starting off in the men's outerwear um it's kind of a small selection Let's see, they have like a few jackets. There's actually this um, Nike one that's actually pretty nice. And it's only $14.99, which is actually a really good price, but um, no denim jackets, unfortunately. These are actually kind of cool. They're kind of like, um, like Tevas. Uh, $9.99 in my size. This jacket's actually pretty sick. Like, very like vintage vibes. Only $9.99. Um, let's see if there's any denim jackets. This one, not really the vibe I'm going for. Also $9.99. And I think this is the only other one. $9.99 as well. Okay, so here I was in the changing room. Um, I tried it on a skirt, I actually really liked it. I can't remember the last time I was in a changing room. I'm surprised it was open. Then I tried on this like really cute vintage floral dress. I wanted this to work so badly, but I feel like it just did not fit me properly, unfortunately. But, like, look at that vintage tag, so good. Well guys, I have to say that place was freaking awesome. Um, I'll tell you more in the car. Wow guys, I genuinely think that this is my new favorite thrift store. I can't believe I've never come here before. So that was the Goodwill. And unfortunately they didn't really have a big denim jacket selection, but I actually did end up getting this skirt which is so adorable and goodwill has these like sales where you can get 50 percent off items so everything with the blue tag was 50 percent off and this one just so happened to have a blue tag so it was originally 6.99 i got it for 350 that is unheard of at valley village like the prices there are so good i felt so inspired i thought there were so many cool interesting pieces there and yeah prices were amazing plus the discounts like oh my god best place to thrift honestly if you notice like some of the prices for the denim jackets like they were all press priced at like nine dollars meanwhile i know for sure valley village would have priced that at 20 to even 25 dollars so honestly i could have spent way longer in there but we have to get on to the next thrift store so next up we're gonna be going to Salvation Army. Okay, so once again, I'm just checking the jackets here. This one's $14.99, but not really what I was looking for. And this is pretty much all the jackets, and I don't think there's any other denim jackets, unfortunately. Some nice, pretty, like, vintage looking guest jeans tag there. $14.99. Alright, so I was not in there for very long. That thrift store I've been to before, it's a lot smaller than many of the thrift stores. So there wasn't a huge selection and to be honest, the prices were kind of steep, especially just coming straight from the Goodwill where everything was like really cheap and like there was a bunch of sales and stuff. Once again, barely any jackets and of course only like a few denim jackets. So couldn't find that unfortunately. I did find this really cute Adidas little like tennis score. It was super cute. I somehow accidentally took a picture of it instead of taking a video. And I think it would have fit me really well. The only thing it was $12. So I just wasn't willing to spend $12 on that skirt. So guys, let's move on. We're gonna go over to Value Village now. Uh, 
don't know if you guys are gonna believe me, but this is literally the exact same skirt I found at the Salvation Army with the little Adidas in the back. And they're only selling it for $4.99. It is green, so a interesting color, but that's a way better price. This little vest from Manager Jeans, super cute. This floral fabric, super cute. It's only $2.99. I might just get this. These are actually pretty cute. I love the cargo look to them. I just don't know about these pockets on the back and also the price. So unfortunately, there isn't even a denim jacket section or any jacket section here. I think I'm like a little too early because it's still summer. So hopefully at the next one. So not a ton of luck in that value village. Yeah, there were just like no denim jackets at all. Like no jackets at all. I guess it's still out of season, but you know, sometimes some thrift stores like have them anyways. So couldn't find that. Didn't find any pillows that I could use for my denim jackets, but I did find this fabric which i thought was really cute it was only 2.99 there's quite a bit of it so i figured i could totally use this make this into something maybe for my next sewing project and after going to the last two thrift stores i kind of remember why everyone loves valley village even though the prices are a little bit more expensive it's just like so big there's so much to look through it's pretty fun so with that being said let's go to our final thrift store it's actually another value village just at a different location so let's head there all right y'all our final destination these jeans are so good i just wish they're a little bit smaller size and also not 15 dollars this could be good for like another jacket but it is Christmas themed, so I don't know. It's also kind of small. There's also a ton more of these really pretty floral fabrics. I just don't know which one I want to get. Okay, so no denim jackets once again, but I did find this really cute vintage belt and this fabric, so not a complete failure. All right, guys, so that was our final stop. Kind of a floral theme going on today, if you haven't noticed. Clearly, I'm into florals recently because I did actually end up getting some more fabric. The reason that why I got this one as well is because I really want to make a dress and the other fabric I got wasn't enough to make a dress. So very excited. Probably gonna do a tutorial, so stay tuned for that. And it was only $3.99, so a great price because sometimes fabric can be expensive. I mean, this is pretty much everything I got today. And the one kind of odd thing out that I did end up picking up is this really precious vintage belt. It was $6.49, so probably more than I wanted to pay for it, but I couldn't resist because look how cute that detailing is, like so precious. It's kind of got like a floral intricate design here on the metal and then this floral continuing through the whole belt love this color brown i have another belt i wear all the time that is a similar color and of course it is a genuine leather made in canada so a really quality piece probably worth the seven dollars i paid for it so very happy about that unfortunately we could not find a denim jacket today at valley village they don't have any jackets out right now so the goal of the day kind of ended up evolving i'll probably end up buying a denim jacket off of poshmark if i've been finding some really good deals on there recently that's where i actually bought my last one but guys thank you so much for joining me on this thrifting journey this is something i wanted to do for quite a while is go to every single thrift store in my city in one day so i'm glad i actually ended up doing it i have to say though if i have to review them all goodwill i think was my favorite out of all of them it was a good size it wasn't too small but it wasn't huge and honestly the prices were amazing i love the fact that they have those discounts 50 percent off a certain color that's a great way for them to get rid of inventory that like probably isn't selling as well i really think valley village should do something like that so totally the place to get good deals and the thing with both goodwill and the salvation army is that you don't have to pay taxes either so that really helps especially if you're buying a ton of stuff and of course everyone's favorite valley village <laughs> i mean yeah it's huge it's really fun to look around there's lots of shoes it can definitely get pricey but you kind of just have to dig because they're 
I've definitely gotten some pretty good deals at Value Village. But anyways, guys, my phone is running out of storage. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like thrifting videos, definitely stick around because there'll be many more to come. And stick around to see what I end up making with both of those fabrics. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Thank you.